So I'm going to talk about tree nutrition now. Speak loud. And I don't believe, or I believe, that nutri tree nutrition in India... Please, please, damn it. Keep quiet, please. Tree nutrition in India is very similar to tree nutrition in New Zealand. But first of all, I'll talk about a new planting. What we would do, what is best practice, would be to soil test first and see what levels of nutrient are available before we start. And pH is very important. So we're looking for a pH of between 6.2 and 6.8. And we will adjust for this before we even plant. We will also adjust phosphorus, potassium, magnesium to the optimum levels before we plant for the whole area. How will you adjust the pH? We'll adjust the pH with the use of lime. So the way we treat these trees from the first the way we treat these trees for the first three years is quite different to when they're in full production. So once we plant the trees, it's quite simple. We would apply NPK 12-5-15, or you have 12-32-16 as well. We would put a small handful around each tree at, um, in the spring when they start to move. And carefully to put it in a band broadcast in a band around the tree, not poured in a line around the tree. That's very important. It's very important for a few reasons. Distance from stem. Laser. What is the uh, width of a band? Okay. From plant? You want to be that far away from the plant? And this is what we call the tree, um, the drip line, or you call the tree basin. So it's really uh, eventually after two or three years, it's out to here. At the moment, it's just in the roots are in there. But anywhere out to there is fine. The reason why we don't want a narrow band, and this applies for big trees as well, is the roots in that area there cannot cope with that amount of fertilizer. It is salt. It will actually damage those roots. It is very poor use of fertilizer. You're not getting, if it's, not, if it's urea, you're not getting in, using all the nitrogen in the plant. The plant cannot take it up. Another important reason is if you are a big enough property and you can afford soil testing, if you take a soil test from there, it would be low. If you take it in the band, it would be too high. It is not accurate for soil testing. It has got to be broadcast. Whether it's, broadcast kar sake to zyada whether it's a small tree or a big tree. And a big tree, where it goes out to here, this is where you broadcast. Very important. So the first three years, two to three years of this new plant, we would put a small handful of 12, 5, 15 in the spring. Then again, six to eight weeks later and then six to eight weeks later after that. And that's it. Split doses, they say, like spring, then you put it in six or eight weeks, then you put it in six or eight weeks. Just like this practice. Just like this practice, you put it in one time, it's good that you put it in split doses. Like we tell you, urea. Urea, you put it in one time. We say three weeks before we say it, then we say it in the other application, then we say it in one month. Now, as we move into full production, 
after three, year three, four, five, we change how we, how we fertilize the plant. It's all about fruit, not about growth. So, ये बोल रहे हैं कि जब production तीन साल के बाद देखा मैं सुना नहीं इनका शब्द तीन heavy production छह साल के बाद production तीन साल के बाद तो तो हम fertilizer dose को भी increase कर लेते हैं. From what we we have observed in in Hachimel so far is you're putting on about five, six, seven, eight times more nitrogen than we do. We put on much less nitrogen. ये कहते हैं कि हम nitrogen कम use करते हैं और हमारे लिए कहते हैं कि हम nitrogen बहुत ज़्यादा use करते हैं. ज़्यादा nitrogen use करने से vegetative growth होती है और disease की ज़्यादा लगती है. If for the adult tree, if you're applying FYM, NPK, and just one kilo of urea, you're applying about five times more nitrogen than we do. If you're applying two or three kilos of nitrogen per tree per year, that is a lot of nitrogen. And my challenge for you, and every farmer here, is to pick 10 trees in your orchard and do not apply any urea. And try it. Then, yeah, observe. Because if you're pruning, cutting out a lot of growth, a lot of vigor, it's coming from nitrogen. It's pulling the branches down and less nitrogen. More spurs, more fruit, better color, better quality, less disease. समझ गए जी आप? ये बोल रहे हैं कि आपने नाइट्रोजन कम करनी है। एक्जिस्टिंग सिस्टम में आप क्या करते हैं कि हेड बैक करते हैं नाइट्रोजन वो यूटिलाइज हो जाती है शूट में। परंतु जब आप ये सिस्टम अडॉप्ट करोगे तो देर विल बी लेस शूट। देर विल बी लेस नाइट्रोजन रिक्वायरमेंट व्हिच विल रिजल्ट इन बेटर कलर ऑफ द फ्रूट बेटर कलर ऑफ द फ्रूट एंड बेटर साइज ये जो बात मैंने आपने सैंक्शन की हुई ना तो उस आधार पे जो आपके नहीं चलो ये सब चेंज आज आज जो रेकमेंडेशन है मचल स्पिंडल की बात कर रहे हैं देखो वो वाला अलग है इसे मिक्स नहीं करो उसे मिक्स नहीं करो उसे मिक्स नहीं करो ना अभी तो हम वही फॉलो कर रहे हैं यस वी फॉलो अभी स्पिंडल की बात कर रहे हैं ना ये बोल रहे ह आगे भी चलो इन लेट्स कंप्लीट की क्या बोलती है आप अपनी करो जैसे पुटाय सर पुटाय यूज़ करते हैं तमाल तीन चार बार जैसे यूज़ करते हैं पुटाय का टाइम आ रहा है यहीं यहीं बताएंगे प्लीज चलिए आम दैट्स प्रीटी मच कवर्स इट द पोटेश यू पुट इन ऑन एट द मोमेंट फ्रॉम द इनफॉरमेशन आई हैव सीन इज ओके द फॉस्फेट � um, give us more time, but I think yeah, yeah. we have to be careful with how much phosphate we put on these steep hillsides. We can actually get a little bit of phosphate coming down into your waterways, and it doesn't take very much phosphate to become a serious pollutant. Okay, but the early days yet. Yeah. Yeah.